The Buckingham Canal is finally being reopened. After years of clearing rubble and shoveling mud, the Buckingham Canal Society is welcoming people to join them in celebrating this milestone, here at the Borton Meadow site. As a patron of the Society and supporter of the project, the Right Honourable John Burko is cutting the ribbon today to officially declare the canal reopened. Well, I can declare it. This 400 metres of restored canal officially opened. I think it's a very memorable moment, so far as I'm concerned. You know, we all talk about the environment, and lots of people love rivers and canals, and they like the idea of the use of a narrow boat, or as today, a trail boat. And I think to be on site in the company of probably 200 people from in and around Buckingham gives me a bit of a glow. It's one of the happier features of being an MP, that you can thank people for the work they've done. You've got 400 metres here of revived waterway that they're celebrating today, and that's a positive for the waterway itself, for surrounding animals in the countryside whose habitat will be better as a result, for those who use the waterway, for those who visit the waterway. So for all of those reasons it's a thoroughly friendly thing in environmental terms. But secondly I think it can actually make a contribution to flood management and risk minimisation so far as the people of Buckingham are concerned. I think, think that Terry Cavender and those who went before him have done a magnificent job of which they and we can all be very proud. It has been more than a hundred years since the Buckingham Farm has seen a boat. But with the tower being included in the Oosweli Way and the water flowing, it shouldn't take long for the site to become lively again. This is Teresa Spiesberger reporting for Buckingham News.